Gosh, baby, easy. Oh, gosh, gotcha. easy. Hey, got it, this old boy. All right, happy Saturday, y'all. I just got back from a little bit of a rabbit hunt here, and I got to feed my pigeons. As y'all can see, everybody's willing and ready to eat. Also, wasn't going to make a video today, but something wild has happened down here in the loft. I've got to talk about it and show y'all what went on. Y'all pigeon people that watch my videos, I really need y'all's input on this one, so stick with me. But first, let me feed these birds and get everybody's bellies full. Billy, you want her hoochie, 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 Makes you wonder who do and ride with someone tonight. Who's called Arthur Nick? I thought I knew her well. I really couldn't tell that she hadn't done the loving on tonight. Who felt the ride when she held me tight? How could I be so fine? If you wonder who do you think? Who do you think? Who All right. So as y'all can see, oh hey, look at that. My roosters have come down here to watch these birds eat. That's funny. Man, that's a muddy mess. No, those roosters haven't been fed today either. Uh, just because I left before daylight and hadn't fed them yet. But anyway, the issue that I got going on here, y'all. I have a pair of birds up here. Their band numbers are both 2016. So, holy cow, they're old birds. Uh, they've laid two eggs here. Then I've got this pair up here. Nothing's wrong with that pair. And then I've got this pair down here. As you can see some eggs there. And uh, anyway, the point is one big old cockbird I got, which I'll show them to y'all here in a minute. He was up here on this nest, all right? Literally sitting on the eggs, okay? I walked in, I was like, wait, that's not the pair to that hen. That's not the daddy to those eggs. So he was up there. Then I walk in, I'm kind of peeling around, cleaning a little bit. He flies off and he goes down here and gets on those eggs and kicks, kicks her off. So my question here is, could he be the daddy to those eggs or was he just sitting on that nest just for kicks? Um, really odd. I've never had one. Then again, of course, I've only been doing this for like a year total. And this is my first real breeding season. I've just never had one sit on multiple nests at a time, especially with a proven pair like this one. So please, y'all let me know. I'll get them up so y'all can see them real fast. There's another shot of my roosters. And y'all can tell these birds were hungry. Of course, they got fed yesterday. And I usually feed them in the morning. Uh, but I was a rabbit hunting this morning. So clearly... Uh, they didn't get fed, but they were ready to go. We got some frozen waters down here right now. I need to get those thawed out and get them some fresh water. But, uh, yeah, weird situation going on down here. Also, those are all the loafers over there. Because I only got three nests going on right now, and which is, I wanted way more eggs than I have right now. I wanted every pair of nesting. Um, but clearly, that's not going on. I'm going to throw some nest boxes in there, some old wooden ones and throw some bowls in there sometime. I might make that into a different video, but yeah, these guys are gonna have to start producing some more eggs or I'm gonna have to start borrowing some, I'm gonna have to get someone else to raise me some young birds, maybe my buddy Greg. This guy right here is the culprit, the one with the white on him, right there in the corner. That dude, he's a bully. He's twice the size of any other pigeon in this loft, it seems. And uh, I don't know, he been up on everybody's nest. All right, snatched him. There he is. Not that it makes really any real difference to y'all out there watching, but this is what he looks like. Very disappointed in his unfaithful actions to his wife. That's down here. Oh, me. All right, and just to prove to y'all I know what I'm talking about, I'll... Good gosh, baby. Easy. Oh, gosh. 
Easy, oh my gosh. Anyway. All right, just to prove to y'all, I know what I'm talking about and I know what birds on what nest. Here's that 2016 band, which gosh, now that I'm looking at it, I don't know that I can even, oh gosh, show it on the camera, okay? This old girl's feisty. See, right there, 2016. I honestly have no idea if y'all can see it on the camera, but the point is this hen is with a male who's also got the basically the same exact band. Watch this. This bird right here, she's so nest driven. She'll fly right behind me. Oh, well, her husband's got, that's her husband right there. That's the other 2016 bird that is supposed to be up there. Oh, well now she's gonna eat, which is fine with me. Let her eat. This bird right here, he got, see, that's her. That's her getting up on there with her husband. She's like, listen, daddy, it's my turn. I was supposed to be up there, but see, it's cold outside. He was like, he saw his eggs not being covered. He had to get up there and do his thing. So this is clearly a pair. These birds are married. Why in the world, old big country was in there with them? I have no idea. That's also the bird, if you've been watching my videos, that beat the tar out of the hen that I had paired him up with, who he went completely rogue and is now with someone else. Point is, weird stuff going on in the loft. Opinions welcome. I'll cut the video off at this because I've just been rambling the entire time. Also, look how beautiful that pigeon is. All right, sorry. Like, subscribe, comment. Pigeon people, let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Sorry for the ramble. Shout out to this pair of birds right here who has let another bird into their relationship. Yo, I was showing this bird and didn't even realize that I got an egg out of this old boy or girl or whatever it is. I thought it was a cock bird, but... I don't know, it's guarding that egg like it's a hen, but then again, both of them will do it. But the point is, shout out to this bird. I'm gonna have some color in the loft. I'm fired up about that egg. Also, there's the cheater. Get out of here, boy. Yeah.